although a year is passing, but nothing changed. Okay, like the pain is still there. You could have found newlyweds Siavash, Gafuri, Azar, and Sara Mamani out at this Montreal restaurant with their best friends Gunash and Nader, but that hasn't been the case in a little more than a year. Siavash and Sara died in Flight 752 in Iran when the plane was shot down in January 2020. And they had thousands of plans for their life, like how they want to renovate their place, like they were sharing their ideas that what they want to do or if they want to have kids in the future, like all of it gone in a moment. Both engineering graduates from Concordia University, Siavash and Sara started their careers and had just bought a house together. They were in Iran to celebrate their wedding with family. On their way home to Montreal, they were among the 176 people on board Flight 752 that lost their lives January 8, 2020. They were just at the beginning of the life. They just started to live their lives. And that's what bothers me all the time. The two couples were fast friends. All of them moved to Canada from Iran, developing a close bond for six years, taking trips across the country together and helping with their own wedding planning. When you immigrate, it's a little bit different. Like, so your friends become like your close family. So maybe by name, they were just a friend. But... They were really like my brother and sister. A lot of moments, you were sharing stories. You were sharing your life, basically. Your secrets, maybe. Your plans. Missing all the laughs, the good times, the memories they had together, the wounds still fresh a year later, and the pandemic making it harder to heal. And we had to spend most of our time uh, staying in the house alone. Um, we had to deal with our memories. We had to deal with our with all, all the things that are going on in our minds. Mainly how their friends suffered an unfair ending on that fateful January day. If it was a natural death, it would be so different. The way that it happened, it, it's, it's making it even harder because you feel that they were supposed to be in this world, but they are not. It's not forgettable and it's not forgivable. In Montreal, Alicia Rubertucci, City News.